Okay. So, I know I haven't been vlogging in a while. Just trying to figure out how I want to continue this moving forward. How I want to continue this moving forward. So, just coming up with ideas, talking to some people, working on some behind the scenes stuff. Definitely, I want to put more workouts in this. So the weather's been getting better. It's been raining a lot lately, so it's been tough because it's really hard to film at the gym. Um, that kind of stuff. So weather's been getting better, so I'm going to do a lot of stuff outside, working out and that kind of thing. Um, I mean, I can do a lot outside because, like I said, doctor said a long time ago that the most I can lift at the gym is like... Um, uh, 30 pounds in each hand and I have those dumbbells so that's fine so I can do that anywhere um, also like I don't know I was kind of making certain things a little bit more professional than I usually do and this whole thing is kind of me in a nutshell this channel so moving forward there's gonna be a lot more of me in it like my style, my idea, my stuff that's in my head. So funnier, absolutely funnier. Like a lot more, with, even with the cooking, I'm going to make it, you know, funnier, more enjoyable. So people are actually getting a laugh. It's not just like you tune in, I do a dish, talk a little bit, and then that's it. You know, that gets kind of boring after a while. Um, I'm going to start posting what I'm doing as well. So in regards to eating, in regards to working out because the whole point of this to start off is journey to prime so it's my journey to getting into better shape getting into having a better lifestyle so I need to be posting what I'm doing for working out and what I'm eating so um, I haven't decided how I'm gonna do it if I take pictures I'll I'll, I'll put them into the uh, video themselves um, whatever I'm cooking if I if it's a big deal like if it's something crazy I'll post it otherwise I'll just kind of talk about it like what I made like I know today uh, I'm probably gonna be getting chicken thighs like boneless chicken thighs and just cooking them on the grill so seasoning grill and then they're done there's no point in really filming too much of that but I am gonna do a side dish a cauliflower thing which is really healthy and um, uh, really healthy and uh, gluten-free, vegan-friendly, whatever you want to call it, all of it is good to go for anybody to have. Um, yeah, so that one I will be posting because that's a cool dish and I want people to see that dish and how easy it is. Um, also, supplement-wise, um, all I'm doing now is uh, I do have a tub of protein so I'll work that in here and there sometimes I like to make protein pancakes so just mix protein and egg whites and it's delicious and um, sometimes I'll mix it in with just plain yogurt and it kind of tastes like a like a cheesecake almost it's weird but it's nice uh, just stuff like that like I don't use I won't use the protein every day I never do but it's it's there uh, the other the other thing I'll be taking is a multivitamin and um, I'll also be taking digestive enzymes a lot of it's in my protein that I take I might take some extra probiotic stuff but also what I started taking that day that I was talking about I was gonna go get digestive enzymes I actually uh, ended up finding also apple cider vinegar. Now apple cider vinegar will benefit you in a whole heap of ways. You know, digestion's better, uh, anti-inflammatory stuff. Um, it's all good, right? And I didn't really want to take the teaspoon of uh, apple cider vinegar, so I found capsules. And literally when you smell these capsules, they smell like vinegar. So I got those, and those I need to take like three times a day with meals. And honestly, since I've been taking it, my stomach is never bloated. Uh, everything feels good. It feels like, this is kind of gross, but whatever. If you haven't taken a shit in a long time, and you finally do, and it's the greatest thing of your life, the way your guts feel afterwards, just amazing. Just relaxed, calm, uh, no agitation, no nothing. So 
I suggest to anyone to take them. They're, they're so good and since it's a natural product, it pretty much works with anything. So if you're taking any kind of medication, it should work. Um, but always check that kind of stuff, you know. I mean, there's Google. If you talk to your doctor, talk to your doctor, whatever the case, just definitely do your research. So yeah, that's where I'm going to be moving forward. A lot funnier, uh, a lot more interesting stuff because, I mean, my close friends are are obviously subscribing to support me, but I want random people to have a reason to subscribe as well, you know what I mean? Like, have them be like, oh, this is pretty funny or this is pretty awesome, so I'm gonna subscribe random people instead of just word of mouth stuff and people that are really close to me, uh, which I appreciate them, absolutely. They're the first ones to say yes. But, uh, I mean, to, to expand this into something huge, that's what I need to do. So that's what's gonna happen moving forward uh, today. Um, I'm planning on doing some grocery shopping because I'm off today. I'm just gonna go meet a friend for lunch right now. We're gonna go for, I'm gonna get some sushi, so that'll be good. And yeah, I'm probably, uh, tonight I'm gonna film the, um, the cauliflower that I was talking about. Probably won't film the chicken, but you know, I'll talk about it, it'll be there. And uh, like I said, I'm gonna list what I've eaten during that day. I'm gonna list, uh, I'm probably gonna go to the gym too. So I'm gonna list what I did at the gym and uh, that kind of stuff. And then like I said, moving forward, hopefully this channel is gonna be a lot better, a lot more interesting, a lot funnier, that kind of thing. And if you guys have any suggestions on what you'd like to see, just let me know. Um, for those of you who have me on Facebook or my cell phone number, do it that way. Um, for those of you who don't, just comment in the videos and if you ever see a video of mine click like I mean if you don't like it don't click like but if you like it just click like helps me out a lot and that kind of thing and uh, let everybody know and I promise it's gonna be better all right cool I don't know if y'all can hear all that it is raining like crazy out here so freaking loud well all of a sudden it just started calming down as soon as I started recording it started calming down I think they know I think they know anyways I am uh, heading down to Superstore gonna get me some chicken uh, I'm gonna get a few veggies I'm gonna get that uh, cauliflower so I can do that cauliflower dish tonight see what else I can get it's gonna, I'm gonna keep it pretty simple. Goal is to keep it at about 50 bucks. That's what I'm planning. Cause I got I got a lot of eggs, um, like rice and carbs and that kind of stuff. I'm good with. I might get a sweet potato, just for here and there. But um, carbs and stuff, I'm good. So it's just getting some veggies and some uh, protein. I got some. I stopped at Sunterra because they do beef bacon over there. And the way they do with the beef bacon is they don't season it in advance, so there's a little bit of sodium, like 85 milligrams or something, but really not that much. So you kind of season it yourself, which I really like. Even if you don't season it, it has some monster flavor to it. So I uh, bought some of that. That'll go with uh, some stuff, you know, either breakfast pizzas, either omelets, or that BBLT, something like that. But... Um, yeah, just gonna go get some groceries and we're gonna do that video for the cauliflower tonight and see how it goes. It's too bad, honestly, it's so bad that me having the day off today that we can't get some sun so I can do my workout outside so I can do some filming. So uh, I am gonna hit the gym after I put all my groceries away and that kind of stuff and I will, um, I'll write down in the video or just do a quick uh, video clip of me video clip god that's so fobby um, do a quick clip of me saying what I did for the workout and that kind of thing uh, so today I took I didn't um, what did I do I took my blood pressure meds and I took the I took the uh, apple cider vinegar before I ate. I went out for sushi. Sushi was real good. I'll post a picture of it. And um, that's all I've eaten so far. Tonight, I'm thinking some kind of beef. Maybe we'll see. Maybe if I just, you know, prep the chicken and there's just... I might just steal three thighs out of that or something like that. Or two thighs or whatever, depending on how big they are. 
maybe I might, or maybe I might get beef. I don't know. We'll see. So, um, yeah, yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking for today. This is how it ends up working on my days off. You know, I would always love to do something, but nice. It was nice to go out for sushi with somebody, but usually ends up happening that way where the day that I have off, I usually end up going out, running errands, doing all that kind of stuff, and it's hard to just relax. And uh, even on my Fridays off, I always work on Saturday, so it's never like two days off in a row, which is kind of shitty. But uh, Vegas, I'm going to Vegas July 7th to the 10th with some friends for my birthday. And then right after that, I'm going to Kelowna for a bit. Uh, with the family for my birthday. So, you know, gonna try my best to get as ready as I can for Vegas. Get that uh, pool body. So, we'll see how that goes. But, um, you know, the journey to prime thing, it's nice to, it'll be nice to get in shape for Vegas, but it's, this is supposed to be the long-term thing, the kind of rest of the life kind of thing. So, we'll see how that goes. And, um, I'm thinking about you know, put in my logo, maybe some quotes, um, you know, some cool stuff on some shirts that I might give away or maybe just like a little bit just to help me out a little bit because depending on how much the shirts are going to cost me, I don't know. I'm still shopping around, but like they're not going to be like 30 bucks or something like that, but if I could maybe break even on them, like five to seven bucks or something, or just give them the way if I get a really good deal, I don't know. But uh, let me know if you guys would be interested in wearing one. Um, I'm not going to make them, you know, like shitty looking, like those normal things where you get a free t-shirt and it just, you kind of just do all the uh, gross stuff in it, like wear the shirt for, uh, you know, I don't know, I don't really know what I'm saying anymore wear the shirt for nothing, just uh, kind of put it on when you're taking out the trash or taking out... What the hell am I talking about now? I don't even know. But, yeah, so, yeah, they're going to be nice shirts. So you can actually wear them out when you're going to a restaurant or going out hanging out with friends or whatever. You don't just need to wear this when you just want to be comfortable. They'll be good for that too, but they'll be nice looking shirts. So let me know if you guys are interested and um, any, any of that kind of stuff. If you wear it, you know, kind of promote the brand. Somebody asks you, oh, where'd you get that? You let them know. Or things of that nature. Um, what else can I say? Oh, so excited about work. Got salesman of the month, so I get to park right in front of the building, which is so awesome. Especially first day in the morning when you show up there, because I got to park a ways away, so I end up having to walk to work like you walk a pretty okay distance to work every day, which I mean is good for the good for the thing that I'm doing, you know, trying to get in shape and all that stuff. But it sucks first thing in the morning. But uh, so I'm going to be parking there for the next month. Hopefully, I can keep that going. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it for now. All right, talk soon. Just finished Superstore. The rain has stopped, which is nice. Did pretty good. Said I wanted to do about 50 bucks. Ended up doing 65. So not bad. I actually saved some money on the chicken because they only had the super big value packs of the chicken thighs. And for me, I mean, I'm just... I'm not gonna make it through that this this week and with freezing, it just, the price was not that great. So, I would've gotten a small package of chicken thighs, but they didn't have the ones I wanted. So, I ended up buying one of those, uh, the full chickens. So that cost me about nine bucks. And so that was good. Um, but, uh, so the chicken was nine bucks. And what else we have? I got some stuff for sandwiches because sometimes I just feel like a sandwich, like a good one with like lettuce, tomato, lots of veggies. I really like veggies in my sandwiches and uh, just some roast beef. Got some provolone, some bread to go with the sandwiches. It's like uh, flax and, what was it? Flax and something else. 
flax and chia, something like that. Some like weird grainy bread. Um, I like those toasted. And um, I got uh, cauliflower, lettuce, tomato, banana. What else? Lettuce, tomato, banana. Uh, I got some chickpeas because I'm going to do this falafel thing on uh, Sunday. Uh, did I get anything else? I had to. <laughs> Wait, that was $65. Uh, what else? Uh, sandwich, sandwich, sandwich. I didn't get any treats, like no cookies or anything like that, which, I mean, that was tough. And... Am I losing it? Yeah, I might be losing it. Chicken, that. I didn't get any beef, except for the roast beef. What? Huh. Tonight, uh, tonight is the day that I'm gonna have my sandwich. I got some beef bacon. Uh, I got that roast beef. It's gonna be like one of those killer sandwich shop sandwiches. Make one of those. I made sure the tomato was very, very fresh because I there's nothing I hate more than soft tomatoes. I need that crispy shit. Crisp. Crisp. Very nice, very nice. I think that's it. I swear I can't remember anything else. Oh, I got sauces too. Yeah, that added up. I got triacha sauce, I got buffalo sauce. I got this like garlic dipping sauce. It's kind of like a mayo thing. And like I said, I mean, this whole thing is about just having a better lifestyle. So the sandwiches here and there, this kind of stuff here and there. I mean, all that, all that stuff's okay. As long as it's in moderation, as long as, you know, I'm just doing my best to get as many of the, um, the essentials in and then I can play around with it a little bit and also I'm trying to I eat a lot for sushi so I think just a sandwich will be good for tonight and I'm gonna do that cauliflower stuff as well uh, I won't have that with the sandwich that'll just be for side dishes and that kind of thing but yeah um, I've been taking my blood pressure for the past few days and I guess that new pill that they put me on, right before I started this whole thing, they put me on a new pill. Uh, well, not a, well, a new pill on top of the ones I'm taking. Just to bring it down a little bit more, because um, high for blood pressure is considered 140 over 90. I'm usually in the 135 to 85 range. That was before the pill. And then when I'm in a doctor's office, you know, you're always going to be a little stressed out. So the blood pressure is a little bit elevated all the time when I'm there. So they put me on one more pill. And lately when I've been taking it, the blood pressure has been 130 over 80. And I've even seen it as low as like one, like high 120s, like 128, 129 over like uh, 79 or 78. So, I mean, it's good. It's working out. Everything's working out. Drinking lots of water. Um, and that kind of stuff, so that's good, yeah. Oh, and bananas. I don't know if I said bananas already, but bananas. And quick oats, quick oats. Because, uh, like I said, I like mixing those with my egg whites to make like protein pancakes. Um, sometimes just making the oats and then adding the protein powder, it's really good actually. And uh, they're good if I ever wanna make, you know, some kind of treats or whatever, like oatmeal. Uh, I make like these like oatmeal protein brownies. So basically just like egg whites, protein, uh, oats, and then you add a banana in and it just it usually bakes like that. You can do that with pancakes or cookies or whatever you want. It's all the same. Those are pretty good for that. Uh, yeah, so that'll be it. Um, uh, I'm gonna go put this stuff away, Do a go, go do a quick workout. And then uh, tonight I'll be fil filming the, the, uh, uh, cauliflower thing. It'll be good. All right. All right. Cauliflower time. How the hell am I supposed to do this? Uh, 
try this out. Yeah. Okay. That's better now. Forty minutes. Now you just gotta, just gotta enjoy yourself now. Not too bad, that's one cauliflower and I've been picking at it a little bit, so there you go.